Hello guys, how you doing? Today I'm gonna show you how to move all your WhatsApp chat history from an iPhone to a Samsung device. Once we finish exporting all your chat history to a Samsung device, we're gonna try to move it to the Poco X3 by Xiaomi. So our final destination is gonna be this Chinese phone, but in the middle, we're gonna use a Samsung phone. As you all know, WhatsApp now allows to move all your chat history from an iOS device to the Samsung device, and recently to the new Pixel 6 and 6 Pro. What we're gonna do is we're gonna move WhatsApp chats from a Samsung device, and then later on to a Xiaomi device. We're gonna start on an iPhone, we're gonna end on a Xiaomi Poco X3. Okay, so let's start it from the iPhone to the Samsung. This is the first step, right? So I have my WhatsApp here, and I'm gonna show you some chats that I have. Okay, I have some emojis. Here I have some data and some documents. Here I have a voice message and some pictures. And here too, I have some files, you know, pictures and videos. So our goal is to move all this chat history from the iPhone to the Samsung. So how can we do this? The first thing we need to do is we need to make sure we have the latest versions of everything on both phones. So you go to the App Store, and you're gonna look for WhatsApp, right? If you see open here, that means that you have the latest version of WhatsApp, so you're good. And if you want to see the version, we have the 221 to 10. The other thing we need to do is, we need to make sure that we have the latest iOS, iOS 15.1. So on the iPhone, I'm good with those two things, the latest version of WhatsApp and the latest version of iOS. Very important guys, you do not have to have WhatsApp installed on your Android device. That's the first step. Second step, you're gonna make sure you have the latest updates on your Android device. As you can see, my software, it's updated. Also, I want you to open the Play Store and you're gonna look for Google Data. On the Google Data, what matter is this, Data Restore Tool. You're gonna click on it and you're gonna make sure you have it installed. If you see here, Update, you need to update the Data Restore Tool. Sometimes just because of this little thing, it doesn't work. So once we have those two, make sure both devices have a lot of battery and then you're going to need a special cable that is going to go from the iPhone to the Samsung device. So you're going to need a cable that goes from lighting to USB-C. Look, as soon as you connect this cable, you're going to see this. Choose an app for the USB device. You're going to choose a smart switch and select just once. What smart switch is doing, oh, look at this. So we need to click trust, trust this computer, trust. I'm going to click next. So this is all the stuff that we can move from the iPhone to the Samsung device, but we don't need everything. We just need WhatsApp, right? Click here to deselect, and we're just gonna select apps. Scroll up, and you're gonna click transfer. We have three apps to transfer, and we're gonna deselect everything. And we're just gonna select WhatsApp Messenger. Click install. And this is the thing, once you see the QR code, you are good. Chances are it's gonna work. So how can you read this QR code? You open your camera, and you move it on top, and this is gonna give you a link that you click and it's gonna open WhatsApp. When you open WhatsApp, you're going to go to a window called Move Chats to Android. If your camera doesn't work on the iPhone, you can still go to that window. You're gonna to have to open WhatsApp and then you're gonna to go to Settings, Chats, and look at this, Move Chats to Android. So we're gonna reach the same window. So either if you read it with a camera or if you go through step-by-step, step, it's gonna be the same, Move Chats to Android. So now we're gonna click Start. and the process continue, transferring data from your old phone. In my case, I have less than 100 megabytes of data, and probably you're gonna have gigs of data to move. This is going really fast, one minute left. It says, okay, look at this, done transferring your data. Done transferring your data, okay? And now we're gonna click on apps, and you can see WhatsApp installed. We're gonna click on this one, and look at this, welcome to WhatsApp, agree and continue. And this is where we're gonna put our phone number. And what is the phone number that we need to put? If you don't know your phone number, you can always go to settings, phone, and this is the phone number, right? 57 315 866 5138. We're gonna click next. And it's asking us, you enter this phone, right? Make sure it's the right number, and you're gonna click OK. And look at this. It says WhatsApp registration code was requested to your new device, and they're gonna give you a code. Okay, and this is the code that they sent us, 500-294. Okay, and look at this, importing chat history. We need permission to restore your chats. You will not be able to import later if you skip this step. So we're gonna click start, and we're gonna give permissions to WhatsApp to access everything. So here's where the importing chat history started. 
look, importing complete. So I'm gonna click next. I'm gonna put my name here. I'm gonna set up right now, daily. I'm gonna choose this account, all right? And here, I'm gonna include videos, and I'm gonna select this account also. So the same account on both, and I'm gonna click done. And this is it, guys. We just transfer all the chats from the iPhone 6S to the new Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 3. So this is done already. We can cancel it, cancel transfer. Your phone number is not longer registered with WhatsApp on this phone. This might be because you registered on another phone. Yes, we did. We're just gonna double check that all the chat history got transferred, right? Look, this is good. This one, oh look, all the files that I have, the videos, play the videos because yes. Sometimes you just see the thumbnail and you cannot play the video. In this case, you can see that everything is fine. Look, the pictures are good, more videos, PDFs, everything is, is working. An MP3 allowed. Okay, it choose YouTube music, whatever. As you can see, guys, all the files got transferred. And if you go to this one also, I have a voice message. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm testing the audio messages. It works. And also this one all the pictures everything is perfect guys now what we're gonna do guys is we're gonna do a, a backup we go to chats and we go to chat backup and we're gonna include videos and we're gonna back it up now one thing guys as you see i didn't move my sim card from the iphone because i don't need to i just needed the code to put it here right i'm not gonna move the sim card until i absolutely needed to move it and look at this guys so we are successfully doing a backup at 5 p.m and the size is 80 max and in theory i can just go here to my xiaomi and install whatsapp and restore a backup right but let's see if, if we can do that or not let's download whatsapp first here on the xiaomi install we're gonna open it and now we're gonna agree and continue and we're gonna put the same number that we put here so the country code is 57 and then the number is 315 866 5138 next we make sure this is the number and look at this i just got a code look and the new code is 923 452 and look at this immediately on the samsung it says that your phone number is not longer registered okay and we're just gonna click continue find and restore your backup continue allow allowed I said backup found two minutes ago size a max so we're gonna restore it your media about 80 max will restore in the background after your messages restore let's wait till it finish because i want to make sure that it's good okay it looks like it's good next i'm gonna put my name again now it's restoring the media finished restoring media 80 max restore and if you, if you open the chats, you're gonna see everything as we used to have it before. All the documents, all the videos. You see the videos are playing. Don't forget to test the videos because sometimes you just see the thumbnail. Okay, the videos are working perfectly. How about this? The audio message. Audio messages on WhatsApp. I hope you can hear this. Okay, it's working the picture here too. And lastly, this, I have pictures and everything got transferred. I just show you how to move all your WhatsApp chat history from an iPhone to a Samsung and then doing a backup on Google Drive and then put it on a Xiaomi. So at the end, this is still working, guys. Once you have the backup on a Google Drive, you can put it on a Motorola, the new Pixel 6 and 6 Pro. Now you can do it directly. You don't need Samsung in the middle. But for Motorola or for OnePlus and other brands, you still need Samsung in the middle. But hopefully, guys, we're going to be able to do this transfer directly to all the phones. And hopefully, in the near future, we're going to be able to transfer from Android to iPhone. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I really appreciate it if you subscribe to my channel. You can help me in that way. And I'll see you on my next video. Thank you. Bye. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good.